The exhibition, based in Space 92, is already open to the public. Organizers Jan Delgado and Jose Luis Martinez explained the reasons behind the exhibition and what else they have planned. He had a, a, a lot of links with Gibraltar because his great-grandfather was Judah Benoliel. He was very well known here and all around the world. So we got in contact with uh, the archives in Lisbon and they gave us the authorization to do this exhibition with at least from 18 to 20 of his photographers. Well, it took us one year to organize the festival. We, all of us, propose a theme. We meet and we try to find out which one has the best uh, uh, story to tell, usually. And of course, to find if technically we can have the right performers to, to deliver something in Gibraltar. So the 21st of June, the festival starts with a night uh, dedicated to the evacuees of Madeira. So all the association of the, the Friends of Madeira are going to say obrigado, thank you. The 22nd of June is a very, very big day. From 9 a.m., Piazza and casemates are full of artists and students. We have approximately 1,000 students who are going to attend to workshops. We have 12 artists delivering workshops. We're going to have a Rio Carnival night. So everyone is invited to dance, uh, have their own fancy dress, there's a contest, there's more than 10 acts on stage. Most of the dance academies of Gibraltar are coming to give their own interpretation of the, of the Brazilian culture. And we have special concerts, we have a Caipirinha bar, all the restaurants are open to propose something around the Brazilian or Portuguese food. Um, so, big day. And on the 23rd, we usually finish the festival in the cave, San Michael Cave, with the concerts of quite prestigious artists in this culture, one from Cape Verde, Carmen Souza, who is uh, singing, of course, in Portuguese, but has a, a jazz touch. We have uh, one of the queen of the fado, Portuguese, called Carminho, and we have a Brazilian band uh, performing Bossa Nova. For the one who likes this, it's going to be quite amazing. Rio Carnival, in Casemate Square on the 22nd, is free to all who wish to attend. The concert on the 23rd in St Michael's Cave sounds like the perfect event for those who just want to relax and listen to music. Tickets can be purchased at 92 Irish Town. With everything going on, it promises to be a very colourful and energetic week.